What's up guys? Today we are looking at how to set the time zone for the Casio G-Shock GWX 8900B. So I got a few questions asking how to set the time zone if my time zone doesn't exist. And the easiest way is in my last video uh, I put up a time zone chart. I'll put it in this video as well. But the easiest way is to find out what your UTC um, hour is according to UTC. So I'm going to take this example. So there was somebody in the comment section looking for Puerto Rico, but there is no Puerto Rico um, time zone specifically. So I went ahead and I found that it is UTC minus four and the two UTC minus fours is SCL and YHZ. SCL is for Santiago, Chile. Halifax, I don't understand, but uh, Halifax, Canada. Okay, so I'm going to use the uh, the world time, uh, which is the second time zone uh, or second time, to show you illustrate this. So on the the top there, it's set to Halifax. So. I just want to show okay oh you, I think Lisbon is hang on a sec I think they're all the same if you notice there are a few time zones that are exactly at the same time so let me just find UTC again And close okay so UTC is 1400 hours right now okay so we need to set it to SCL or YHZ it doesn't matter so I'll look for either or just searching up What's that? WLG, PPG, Honolulu, ANC, I'm not sure, not sure. That was Los Angeles, Denmark. No, that DEN is not Denmark. Uh, Mexico, that's New York. Here we go. So it is 10 hundred hours for Santiago. So. If you're living in Puerto Rico, you set it to SCL and you'll get the correct time. I think the next one is Halifax. Yep. See, and Halifax YHZ is also 10 hundred hours. Okay, so I'll do another exam example. Just say you're living in somewhere that is plus three hours. So UTC plus three. What do we have? I'm just looking at the chart there. So M O W, we have J E D. Those are the two ones. So we know that it's about two o'clock UTC right now. So we need UTC plus three. Oops, sorry, out of the camera angle. So those MOW, which is 17, and also JED, which is 17. So UTC plus three, it's two, that is plus three. So there you have it. And you can also check it against your, your phone, you know, you can check the time. If the time zone doesn't exist, not all G-Shock watches correspond to the same time zone. Some have extra, some have less, but you'll be able to find one of these time zone codes that matches your time zone. Okay. So if you have any questions, leave it in the comment section down below. Um, if you want me to explain something a little bit clear, let me know. Um, 
Yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.